today. I know, yeah. Even our background has had know. such sunflowers back there. Yeah, I just love it. Every time I see like a like a sunflower or a flower stand on the side of the road, I'm like, oh, I wish I had like cash. I need to pull over and get some of those for my house, you know, because it's just that time of year. Everything's so pretty. And, and of course, finally some weather to match it, guys. Uh, it finally feels like summer. It looks like summer. We've had some sun the last couple of days, which has been really nice. 66 in Burlington, 61 in Montpelier and Rutland, 57 in Bennington. Very seasonable conditions and a partly cloudy sky, maybe a little bit more of that cloud cover over Vermont, perhaps compared to northern New York uh, and some fog in northern New York, too. But you guys, it's quiet. It's a beautiful morning. I do want to zoom out, though, to tell you the whole story. We have that system. We've been talking about it for a few days. It's inching its way up the Atlantic coast. It's going to hug the coast, but that does mean it's going to skim us. So certainly New Hampshire with a little bit of rain this afternoon. But on the other side of the coin here, you have the high pressure system that's off to our west, and that's essentially just fighting this thing off. So as these two systems compete, we're just kind of stuck in the middle. And for the most part, it's mainly just some clouds that we'll see at times this afternoon, and especially the further east that you go. So kind of that mix for the Adirondack, 77 in Lake Placid, 80 in Malone, 81 in Plattsburgh. Similar on the other side of the lake, especially in the lower spots, low 80s expected there. A little bit more cloud cover again the further east that you go. Mid 70s for those in Montpelier, Chelsea, Lisbon, right near 76 or so. And to the south, a little bit cooler again, just a more cloud cover to keep you guys slightly cooler and maybe a stray shower too. 74 in Escutney, 69 in Peru, 78 in Pulteney, but still not too bad of an afternoon even there. We'll have some nice weather to enjoy in between some of those clouds. So here it is, future cast uh, showing that mix of sun and clouds and otherwise mostly quiet conditions and generally pretty pleasant ones. Lots of sunshine expected for Friday. It really is going to be a gorgeous afternoon tomorrow. To cap off a generally nice work week, we have some changes though for the weekend. Come Saturday, a quiet start, mix of sun and clouds, not bad at all, but during the afternoon, some isolated to scattered showers and thunderstorms are possible. Obviously, coverage-wise, here not anything's too big. I think if you have plans to be outside on Saturday or Sunday, I wouldn't cancel those plans, but no, both of the days on the weekend, you are going to have to keep an eye out for some of those scattered showers and thunderstorms with some sun in between. Quiet Monday, Tuesday, but plenty hot. And next week does look like we'll have some storms and some humidity.